Now, uh, here is a group of hepatocytes. Looking at it more closely, we see that these hepatocytes are arranged radially away from the central vein and towards this portal tract. When we take this portal triad at the center and the central veins at the periphery, we form the functional unit of the liver or the asinus. So these asini are clustered around this vascular stalk. And if we focus on this section, we have this. For our purpose today, we will represent that uh, portion of the asinus in this form. On, other, on either side of this one cell layer thick are low pressure vascular channels called sinusoids. And these are highlighted here with the color pink. Now let's take a quick look on what happens when we give the contrast. So this represents the blood flow from the hepatic artery and the portal vein. This blood mix within the sinusoids here and approach the parenchymal cells for nutrient and gas exchange to occur. After that, uh, blood is drained into the central vein here and is eventually drained into the hepatic vein. Later, we'll be describing hepatocytes as having a sinusoidal membrane here and a canalicular membrane here. So just remember that. Uh, sinusoidal membrane and the canalicular membrane. So again, this is the portal triad with small branches delving into the hepatic sinusoids here while the bile canaliculi drain into the bile ducts. In order to appreciate the degrees of enhancement, we will use this diagram to represent a non-contrast study. So in this non-contrast study, um, we have pale vascular structures, dark hepatocytes, and dark extracellular compartments. During the arterial phase, the hepatic artery is enhanced and to a small extent, the spaces in between the hepatocytes or the interstitium. During the portal venous phase, the parenchyma is enhanced to a greater degree. And in the equilibrium phase, to a lesser degree. We can say therefore that on the arterial, portal venous, and the equilibrium phases, the contrast is mainly in the vascular and the extracellular spaces. How about in the 20-minute delayed scan or hepatobiliary phase? The contrast now is mostly within the hepatocytes, within the hepatocytes, and in the biliary ducts, and it's aptly called the hepatobiliary phase. So again, during the dynamic phases, contrast is mainly in the vascular and extracellular compartment, while in the hepatobiliary phase within the hepatocytes and biliary ducts. Uh, the arterial phase would show us the vascularity of a lesion. For example, this is a classic uh, hypervascular lesion in HCC. It is said to be hypervascular because of its increase. Uh, supply from the hepatic artery. So this is a characteristic of hepatocellular carcinoma that as it becomes more advanced, it gains more hepatic arterial supply with a concomitant decrease in the portal venous and bile duct components. So if this is a section of normal tissue in the arterial phase, an, an advanced HEC would be obviously hyper-intense compared to the background.